Well, all new at six, technology from outer space is transforming dentistry here on Earth. A new robot is now on the job for a dentist here in Central Florida. Fox 35's Esther Bauer shows us how it helps with implants. When we see rockets lift off here on the Space Coast, we often talk about how this technology being tested in space can benefit us here on Earth. Dentists are now benefiting as robots move into the operating room. So it goes and it shows me exactly where I need to go. Robot arms are inside a patient's mouth, being guided by a dentist to give them new dental implants in minutes instead of hours. But you can take the best surgeon and pair him with robotic guidance and you're going to get perfect level results. Dr. Siobhan Kessim is one of the first dentists using the world's only robot-assisted dental surgical system cleared by the FDA. It was developed by the company Neosis and the robot's name is Yo. Me. I'm not gonna lie, it, it, your robot doing that um, is a little nerving. Shenny Aladdin had concerns about a robot going inside her mouth, but after her procedure at Restoration Dental in Claremont, it just felt like I didn't have much done. Like I just had like a cleaning done or something, you know. So it was it was a quick recovery. Quick recovery because the robot does less damage than human hands. Microscopic level of precision and become very minimally invasive. We're able to place implants in under a minute or two without having to do any incisions, any cutting, and therefore we don't cause any pain. Astronauts on the ISS use this haptic technology to control rovers and other tools that may be hard to see, similar to a dentist trying to see inside someone's mouth. Hitting nerves and arteries and, and other landmarks that we wouldn't want to drill into. Yomi the robot never works alone. A dentist is always telling it what to do and where. Shenny says the procedure went better than expected and she's getting her life back with two new teeth. I can eat all my favorite foods. And this robot can also handle patients that may be squirming around during the operation. It's using GPS and it will change its path if the patient moves. Reporting in Brevard County, Esther Bauer, Fox 35 News.